It's super important to be able to have time, you know, for your significant other, of course, with a newborn, but also being able to do things together with the baby is also really special and, um, and, you know, getting familiar and comfortable in the kitchen is a big part of that for us as well. How has it changed your relationship at all? Like, are you able to make that time for yourselves and kind of, you know, take a step back and kind of, you know, let it all sink in, but it has to change your relationship at all. With my husband or with my yeah. mom? With your husband. I mean, your mom, I'm sure you guys are best friends. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, I think it's obviously when you're able to um, have that experience with your uh, significant other, it's such a beautiful experience and a beautiful journey and, um, and a great bonding uh, experience as well. So I feel really just blessed to be able to have that as being part of this journey and um, and to experience that day by day as well is, is really incredible. Yeah, are you guys able to do date nights at home and things like that? Or you're like, I don't have time for that. <laughs> no, 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 it's super important to be able to have time, you know, for your significant other, of course, with a newborn, but also being able to do things together with the baby is also really special. And, um, and you know, getting familiar and comfortable in the kitchen is a big part of that for us as well. Are they, are your parents just absolutely loving grandparent life? Yeah, they really love it. I think both of them just, um, it's such a great and cool new role for both of them to be able to experience. And also for me as their daughter to watch them in this new role is such a beautiful thing and um, and something that I just love to soak up every minute of watching and also to see my siblings become uh, an aunt and, uh, and uncles is really exciting as well. So it's, it's new roles that everyone's really excited about. So I feel very blessed. Definitely. And I mean, how are you enjoying this new role? What has been the best part? What has been the most challenging part of the past few months for you? Um, I mean, I love it. I, I've been enjoying every minute of it. I think motherhood is such a huge gift and it's again, been such a silver lining in this crazy year of 2020. And um, I'm enjoying every minute of, of being a new mom and, um, and having a little, a little baby and just experiencing all that learning so much i go to my mom for everything and just being able to um to be open to learning so many new things and be uh introduced to so much with having a little baby and it's just been such a great experience and also being able to pass on traditions and i know that i grew up watching my mom just bake a lot so being able to watch her bake more and, and me bake and also dabbling in the whole kitchen uh, with cooking and just have new experiences as well is really exciting. Definitely. I know they never they say you're never fully prepared to have a child. Did you feel that you were prepared and what kind of surprised you the most? I think uh, being the oldest in my family, you get a little <laughs> preparation. <laughs> if you're the oldest in your family and you have a bunch of like younger siblings and younger cousins, I think you get a little bit of um, a little bit of an idea into maybe what some of that will be like having a baby and uh, and just being able to multitask. So I feel a little bit like I had some preparation and um, I would say that I just learned something new every single day. And again, my mom has been so amazing and so helpful and she's like a well of wisdom that I'm constantly going to for more information and, and learning so much more and calling her for this, calling her for that. And I did that throughout my whole pregnancy as well. So. I just feel really lucky to be able to have that source uh, to go to and to ask so many of these questions. Definitely. I know for me, it took, you know, definitely a few months to try to start feeling like myself again. Are you starting to feel like that? Because, you know, you go through a shock, you know, your hormones, your emotions. Like I know for me, the first three months, everything that happened made me cry. <laughs> but <laughs> are you feeling like that too? Or are you starting to kind of slowly feel like yourself again? Well, I think, I mean, I don't think you go back to feeling like, who you were prior to having a baby because you're now a mother and so you're feeling you know who you are as a mother and that's such a beautiful thing and it's you know something that you get more comfortable with as the days go on the days go by but I don't ever you know I'm not waiting to go back to who I was prior to having a daughter I'm embracing who I am as a new mother and just being able to have the gift of her in my life is such a huge blessing so um so yeah it's been really just is such an amazing thing and being able to have the holiday season around in that is also really exciting for me.